Hi students, we are in language arts today and I want to review with you guys about digraphs. So can you guys shout out what digraphs are? Digraphs are two letters that make one sound. So let's go over um, the uh, digraphs that we learned in the past just to refresh our memory. So we have this word, or we have these two letters, S-H, and together they make what sound? Shh, shh, shh. And now we have th. Now what, what sound does th make? Th, th, th. In the below the th we have ch, which makes what? Ch, ch, ch. Choo, 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 ch. And then we have wh, which makes the what? Wa. Wah, wah. Because remember, we don't hear the H in WH because the W is the star and the H is just the um, person backstage helping out the W. Wah, wah. So when I point to one of these digraphs, I want you to um, shout out the sound. Cha, cha, cha. What about this one? Th, th, th. Wa, wa, wa. Sh, sh, sh. Cha, cha, cha. Th, th, th. Wa, wa, wa. Hmm. So going back to the Shh sound. What's what's a word that has the sh in it? There is shell. Sh L L like a seashell you might find in the sea. Now what about the WH? There is w L well. Well flip in the ocean. Well. And what about cha, cha, cha? There is chomp or chop. And then what about the th? Th, th, th. And then there's m, off, moth. So it's really cool about digraphs. They can appear anywhere in the word, in the middle, in the end of the word, in the beginning of the word. But digraphs can, can appear, appear all over the words. But just uh, wanted to refresh your guys' memory on digraphs. And if you have any questions about digraphs, please let me know. Thanks.